वंदे गुजरात Hello dear students how are you all hope you all are good and may you all are ready for the second semester yeah very good dear students there are so many animals around us like wild animals pet animals and many more today i am going to ask some questions related to the animal world and you are going to answer them okay so shall we start um can you tell me the name of the animal who barks like bow 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 hmm think very good it's a dog very good students okay the second one now tell me the name of the animal who gives us a wool oon एवं क्यों प्राणी है जे अपन ने ऊन आपे कमॉन यस वेरी गुड इट्स अ शीप घेटू सो लास्ट एंड फाइनल क्वेश्चन फॉर यू ऑल टेल मी द नेम ऑफ द एनिमल हु हैज लॉन्ग ट्रंक शॉर्ट टेल लॉन्ग टीथ आउटसाइड हम्म correct it's an elephant students elephants are so interesting yeah their food their lifestyle their body structure yes i would like to show you a small video clip of elephant showing their natural life so enjoy the video
Hmm, students, did you like the video? Yeah, very good. So, today we are going to learn about an elephant life. Okay? And uh, would you like to know more about an elephant? Yeah. So, today we are going to learn activity 7 from your unit 3. So, open your textbook, page number 34, activity 7A. Activity 7. A. Read the paragraph and answer the following questions. The elephant is the largest mammal on the earth. His weight is about 4,989 kg. He eats grass, leaves, fruits and birds. He spends 16 hours a day for eating. He eats 224 kg of food per day. The adult male is called a bull. The adult female is called a cow. The baby elephant is called a calf. His eyesight is poor. He can smell from 3 to 5 kilometers away. He has the largest brain in the animal kingdom. His sound is referred to as grunts, purrs, bellows, whistles and trumpeting. His life span is up to 70 years. Elephant's trainer is called Mahat. Elephants can hear by feeling the vibration in the ground with their feet. Okay students, so this is the paragraph. I must say, you are more interesting in elephant's life, yeah? So, now you have to tell me the words which you mark or which you find unfamiliar. Okay students, so tell me the words which you find unfamiliar. Yes, there are words like mammal, grunts, barks, trumpeting, whistles, trainer, grunts, span. Oh, so, so many words are there, yeah? So firstly, we are going to discuss them first. Okay students, so let's see the first word. First one is mammal. Mammal means an animal who provides the growing one with everything it wants and nourishes their young ones with milk. The elephants are also mammal. Elephant feeds their young ones with their milk. So they are mammals. For the word mammal, I would like to show some pictures which are showing mammal animals. Got it? Okay, then let's move on the next word. We have next word is barks. Here we have a list of elephant's food in paragraph. There is a word barks. Barks means outer portion of the wood. That means vrukshni chal. Students, barks means vrukshni chal. Jharni chal elephant khai shake chai. For that, I would like to show you some pictures of elephant eating barks. Clear the meaning of barks? 
Okay, then let's move on the next word. Students, here we have the next word is grants. Students, we have some names of different sound which are referred by an elephant. From them, the first one is grunts. To grunt means to sound unclearly. Sometimes animal makes noise which are unclear. You cannot hear them properly or in a complete way. This kind of sounds are called grunts. Got it? So let's see the next word. Here the word purse is also a type of sound. Generally, animals make different noises in different moods. When animals are sad or feeling pain, they make noise is called purrs. So students, purrs means dard bharyo avaj, dukhno avaj. Okay? So let's see the next word. The next one is bellows. Bellows is also a type of sound made by elephant. Bellows means a deep roaring, shouting. A person or an animal bellows in pain or anger. So a sound of an anger is called bellows. Got it? So let's move on the next word. Here we have a whistle. Students, you may very well familiar with this word. Yeah? Whistles means sisoti jevo avaj kadevo. Yes, my dear students, animals are also whistling sometimes. So here, whistles is presenting a noise of an elephant. Got it? So let's move on the next word. Here we have another word is presenting elephant's sound. Trumpeting. Students, trumpeting means to shout loudly. Sometimes elephants trumpeting, that means shouts loudly. To call their near ones. So, got the meaning of the trumpeting? Okay, so let's move on the next word. Students, here we have a word span. Span means duration. Garo, I would like to give you an example for the word span. My grandfather did so many social work during his life span. That means, Mara Dada Ji e, emna jeevan gala darmyan ghana bada samajik karyo karya hata. So, got the meaning of the word span? Okay, very good. So, let's move on the next word. Students, here we have a sentence an elephant's trainer is called Mahat. Yes, trainer. Trainer means a person who trains or teach the person or animal is called trainer. For example, the dog's quads are very well trained by their trainers. Okay students, so here are the words which you find unfamiliar. Okay, now I would like to show you a video clip of elephant making different noises. So enjoy the video.
This is the paragraph after we discuss some unfamiliar words. Now we are going to discuss some questions related to the paragraph. Okay? Are you ready? So let's start with the first question. First question is what is the average weight of the elephant? Hmm. Students, for the answer, you have to read first line of the paragraph carefully. The answer is in the first line. Hmm. I think you have find the answer. Yeah? Yes, correct. The answer is the average weight of an elephant is about 4989 kg. Very good my dear students. Now write down the answer in your book. Great! Have you done it? Good! So let's see the next question. How many hours does an elephant spend for eating? Ok students, again read the paragraph carefully. The answer is there. Very good! The answer is an elephant spends 16 hours a day for eating. Okay? So, write down the answer in your textbook. Have you all done it? Good. So let's see the third question. Third question is How much food does an elephant take in a day? Ok students. In the paragraph we have information about elephant's food. Read the paragraph and try to find out the answer. Read the paragraph carefully. Come on students, try your best. Hmm, anyone have find the answer? Okay, great. The answer is An elephant takes 224 kilograms food in a day. Excellent students. Very good. So write down the answer in your textbook. Have you all done it? Okay. So let's see the next question. Students, here we have fourth question is What does an elephant eat? 
Okay students, again we are asked about elephant's food. Before we discuss about elephant's food. So read the paragraph and find the elephant's food items. Read the paragraph carefully. Hmm, have you got the answer? Great! The answer is an elephant eats grass, leaves, fruits and barks. Students, here I have some pictures which shows elephants are eating. So check out the pictures. So students, these are the food items. So write down the answer, the fourth answer in your textbook. Have you all done it? Great. So let's see the fifth question. Here we have fifth question is... What are the unique facts about an elephant? Students, here we have to answer about unique facts of an elephant. Unique facts. This word you may find unfamiliar. Unique facts means an information which you didn't know before. Yes. There are some informations about an elephant which you have heard first time. So, let's try to find them. I would like to give you some hint for the answer. In paragraph, we have given the names of elephant family and some unique qualities of an elephant. Now, can anyone guess the answer? Students, this is the paragraph. Try your best to get the answer. Hmm, I think you have find the answer. Yes, correct. The answer is Students, I have highlighted the answer for you all. Can you see it? The adult male is called a bull. The adult female is called a cow. The baby elephant is called a calf. His eyesight is poor. He can smell from 3 to 5 kilometers away. He has the largest brain in the animal kingdom and elephants can hear by feeling the vibration in the ground with their feet. So, students, this is the unique facts of an elephant. So, write down the answer from the screen. There are many unique facts about an elephant like the adult male is called a bull. The adult female is called a cow. 
The baby elephant is called a calf. His eyesight is poor. He can smell from 3 to 5 km away. He has the largest brain in the animal kingdom. Elephants can hear by feeling the vibration in the ground with their feet. Have you all wrote it? Good. So let's move on the sixth question. The sixth question is How many years can an elephant live? Hmm. Very good question. And very easy question. Yeah? I think you all have already find the answer. Okay. The answer is in the second last line of the paragraph. Can anyone tell me the answer? Yes. The answer is His lifespan is up to 70 years. Yes, good, very good students. Students, write down the answer in your textbook from the screen. Done it? Good. So, let's see the seventh question. Which words describe elephants' sounds? Hmm, students, did you remember the words which we discussed before representing the sounds of elephant? The sounds of anger, pain, shouting. Yeah? So, read the paragraph carefully and find the answer. Yes, the answer is in third last line. Very good. So, write down the answer in your textbook. The answer is words like grunts, purrs, bellows, whistles and trumpeting describe elephants sound. Students, here again I would like to show you a video clip of an elephant making different sounds to clarify this answer. Okay? Students, I think you all are clear about elephant sounds. Okay? So, shall we move on the 8th and our last question? 8th question is, who trains the elephant? Students, we discussed before the word trainer. Do you remember? Yes. Trainer. Trainer means a person who Trains a person or an animal is called a trainer. So, here we have to find a trainer of an elephant. So, read the paragraph carefully and find the answer. Students, Read the second last line carefully and give me the answer. Hmm, can anyone tell me the answer? 
Very good. Excellent. The answer is Mahaut trains the elephant. Very good students. Now write down the answer in your textbook. Mahaut trains the elephant. Excellent. Very good. Students, hope you all get the perfect idea of the comprehension. Yes, hope you all enjoyed today's session. We had a great time, yeah? Okay students, here we are ending our today's session. See you all in the next episode. Till then, goodbye and good luck. Gujarat